What's up, guys? Listen, I wanted to film this quick video because I'm I'm seeing so many life insurance agents who absolutely struggle. I'm talking about struggle bus to generate leads and to sell services or sell life insurance, right? And so what I wanted to do is kind of give a, a different take on selling life insurance. So what do I mean by that? What I mean is if I were to start a life insurance agency today, no clients, no marketing budget, nothing, I wouldn't be going straight out and making posts about, you know, GoFundMe and, you know, just asking for money from other people and how that's such a horrible thing. And you should have life. Like everyone does that. Like the life, life insurance agents, for the most part, have the worst marketing of all time because none of them are good at it. All of them do the same thing. 99% of them. Obviously, the ones who are really, really well off don't do that. But most new agents go the go they they go the GoFundMe route and try to use that as like their marketing pitch. It's it's horrendous. It really provides no value or substance. So if I was a life insurance agent today and I wanted to start a new business where I can lead into selling life insurance where it makes sense then I would hit people where you're going to be able to provide the most value. So I would provide a debt remediation service, right? I think Dave Ramsey, even though we all hate Dave Ramsey, right? Because he's a little bit too far off on, on one end of just taking advantage of people. But what I would do is I would offer debt remediation services to help people who have a lot of debt or are trying to cancel debt up within their... Some people just need guidance, right? So I would work with them to help clear out their credit card debt, put plans in place. The great thing is this, you guys as life insurance agents can invest into programs that will literally formulate everything that's needed for a person to get rid of their debt in a fraction of the time if they stick to that plan. And what you're doing is when you're able to get into that, one, you're getting a look at their financials. Two, you're able to formulate a plan for them and you can charge them for that plan each month, right? To help them stick to that plan. And not only are you looking at their financials and helping them clear up their debt, but now you're opening up availability. You're opening up debt and clearing all that out. And now you have an available budget to work within for life insurance services. And you've already provided them a huge service that they've paid you for to help remove a month to month cost that they have or multiple multi uh, month to month costs. And now you can go ahead and say, all right, now we need to get you into life insurance, whether it's a term policy to cover, um, depending on how much available and what the needs are of that person. But you can open up plenty of opportunities. You can sell uh, burial policies, you know, final expense. You can sell term. You can sell whole life policies. You can sell ULs, IULs, right? There's so many different avenues that you could go with the life insurance route. And you started by not talking about life insurance, just helping people get out of debt with simple steps. And if you're not good at it yourself, then maybe you should go ahead and go get that, you know, that those programs that are available online and go get yourself out of debt, learn how to do it. And once you're able to do that and you have available income to spend, now you can work with other people on the same thing. And so you're opening up an opportunity, you're building trust in the process, and it makes having a life insurance conversation that much easier. Because I promise you, there aren't as many, there's probably more people who are licensed to sell life insurance than there are people out there looking for life insurance. And so if every conversation you're having is this, you know, argument of you trying to convince someone to get it, chances are they're not going to retain very well. So uh, this is just a different method, right? There's obviously a lot of different ways to be successful with life insurance. But if I was starting today, this is the method I would use.